Hello, Scott Sullivan, welcome to you live from Las Vegas, Nevada. It is October 19, 2015. Let's take a look at the time. 7.46 in the morning, okay? and we're talking about the right way to role play. And like sometimes I'll meet with salespeople and I'll say, hey, I'll hop into your role play. They go, oh, I role play every day. Okay, well, who do you role play with? Oh, myself, <laughs> right? Are you kidding me? You're going to role play with yourself? How is that supposed to help you out? How is that supposed to get you better at what you do? So there's a two-person minimum, kind of like if you go to a comedy club and there's a two-drink minimum. It's the same type of a situation for, for role playing in the sales process. You need two people minimum. And the thing is, is the more people that you get in this process, the more damaging it can be for you. So me, I have a personal belief that the more, the most amount of people you can have in a role play without it being like in a classroom group setting where there's like four people that, or people sitting at a table is four, right? So, but once again, you have to have an intention. You have to have a reason why you're doing this. And everybody at the table needs to know why. So if you're working with a partner, you know, you sat down and you worked with them and you figured out why you need to work with them, that partner needs to know it. So there's a two person minimum. Now, here's the thing, that person and you got to know exactly what's going on. So you might have to fill them in and say, here's the struggle that I've been having. Or you could say, hey, look, I don't want to tell you what the struggle is, but I want you to see if you can pick it up without me having any other issues, okay? So there's a two person minimum for you to do role play that's really going to help you out. And you know, sometimes people say, but Scott, I don't have anybody to role play with. Okay, last ditch effort, like right now, I'm shooting this video on my cell phone. Pull out your cell phone, pull out a camera, you know, uh, grab a tripod, do what you can to get that video recorded and just go through the process. That is like a last ditch effort. I don't recommend it, but if you have nobody else to work with, do that. You know, I've, I paid neighbors, I paid strangers. I put an ad out on Craigslist for people to watch me do my sales process. You know, I've had to figure out a way to be creative and sales is entirely creative and that's what you need to know, okay? So find a second person because you need two, you need two to tango, right? Go out there, role play. Now, if you could do a small favor for me in the box down below, leave a comment, question, or story, that'd be fantastic. To the right or to the left, there's a subscribe button, subscribe. And then you can send it out to all your friends via StumbleUpon, Facebook, Twitter, Google+, LinkedIn, Scott Silvenbell. Only Scott Bell. Someone will see you soon. Thanks for watching. Aloha.